hairdressing 101. Here we go now. So, press search. Yeah. So, hairdressing 101, and we're doing the Suez Canal, right? So, it's 120.1 miles long. 120.1 miles long, right? And there is no locks on it. Like in here in England, you've got locks every whatever, however, whenever. Uh, if you know about the Bedford experiment, right? The Bedford experiment. Let's have a look at this one, Dad. This is getting deep, this. I've just done a long video. I'm not bothered putting that up, but... Um, Bed Ford Experiment. Right, the Bedford Experiment, look, proved that the that the Earth is flat as such, yes? Because right, the Bedford level experiment is a series of observations carried out along a six mile length of the old Bedford River on the Bedford level of the Cambridge Fens in the United Kingdom during the 19th and early 20th century to measure the curvature of the earth and it ends there why would they tell you eh? so over six miles there was proven no curvature whatsoever that was over six miles Right, why are they showing you, it, it's so funny this, if you look on Google, um, it just you just see curves and globes and all sorts of nonsense, right? So, the real, the real golden, the goodness is in the Suez Canal, if you want to get to the core of it, 120.1 miles. And there's no locks in it. No locks in it whatsoever. There's no curves. There's no, um, there's no, it's just a straight canal all the way. 120 miles. You can see videos. In fact, let's bring it up. Because this is a beauty, this. This is a real eye opener for those if you want to see. Right, so look, check this out for a video. You can see loads of, because it's a shipping lane as well. Um, Suez Canal. Videos. Right, watch this. This is fantastica. Here we go. Right, what's your thing is? Watch this one. 120.1 miles long. Let's turn it sideways. Right, look. All the way along it. So you've got you've got loads of videos, yeah? And all you will ever see is no locks, no up and downs, just flat level all the time. So explain that one. If you still, all I'm asking you to do, I'm not saying it's flat, I'm not saying it, I am saying it's not round. I am not saying it's flat. I'm saying something far stranger. So, look, it just goes on and on and on. Forward the videos. And you've just got flat freighters. How do you explain that, Dad? Look, no locks at all. It's just going flat all the time. Look, on and on and on and on.
120 miles with no locks. Come on, please tell me. Please tell me what you believe. That's the, this is a good one, this. 120.1 miles, no locks, it's just flat. Think about it. Addressing 101, anyway. So. How is everyone, anyway, in the lockdown? Number two, let's hit the number one. Yeah, the Bedford level experiment, six miles, no curvature. But they tell us, remember, scientifically, if you're a science believer, if you are a part of the um, religion of science, it is a religion. Science is definitely a religion. In the middle of, in the middle of the earth, it's the middle of the earth. If you look at a ball, go on, Dad. Indoctrination 101, this should be called. If you're wearing a mask, by the way, as well, ask someone to fart in the room. See if you can smell it. If you're eating f food of any sort, where's it come from? Has it got coronavirus on it? Oh, no, I can't believe I said that. Try not get clicked. Stupid. Stupidity. If I get clicked for that one word. I'm twitching. Come on, Dad. We're waiting for you. Right, let's have a look what it's put. So, it's the middle of the earth. If you look at a ball, the centre of the ball, it goes round the middle, no mountains. Right, so if you've got a flat part, yeah, you have to have something that makes up for it. If you've got a circle and you've got a flat part for a long period, yeah, like in uh, the longest bridge in China, the Dongwang down China, the longest bridge in China is 102 miles long. I'm boring in now, it's yawning, look. <laughs> Tell her, do that, look. Look at Cameron go. He's saying this idiot, look. So, you can't have it both ways, right? You can, if you can have it, if it's flat for a long period of time, there's got to be a part where it's really curved. Yeah? Mm. It can't just be the same. It can't just be flat for it. Right, get a tennis ball. Right, you squash your tennis ball down flat. That means the part where it goes down is even more curved. Do you see, do you understand what I'm saying? So, 
what would be an easy explanation for this, you know, that we can balance stuff and, and water always finds its level, yeah, and lighthouses work and have been seen up to 200 miles, is it's flat. I'm just saying that's an easier explanation, yeah? That's all I'm saying. I'm not here to tell you what to think. I couldn't care less what you think. It's your choice. I'm just saying, use your head. I couldn't care less what anyone else thinks. Just use your head. Beneficial to you. If you believe what someone else tells you, it's only going to be to your detriment. Because people are telling you things because it helps them. When your family tells you something with stern belief, it's worth looking into, at least. If anyone disagrees with anything I say, just please tell me. I'm not saying it's flat, by the way. What I, what I would, what, if I told you what I thought, they used to lock people up for things like what I thought the world was actually. So, freedom of speech, it's not going away. Just say what you really think. But actually have a meaning, actually have something, have proof. Like, remember, Elon Musk showed you that there's a Tesla car an, an absolutely normal Tesla car in space now floating around. Yeah? He actually said that. It says, quote, it actually look, it looks so real. It, it's got to be real because it looks so fake. His words, not mine. These are just actors on your tell eye vision. But whatever, believe whatever you want to believe. Right, eyebrows time. This is how you do eyebrows, by the way. Get a number one. Here we go. Always pull skin back. Make it a sharp cut. I'm going to have to do a, um, what do you call it? A toenails one next. Because I, I, I had angle grinder on his earlier. There were sparks and everything early, weren't they? He's, he's got to his head, look. Dad, I had angle grinder out earlier, didn't I? He's thinking about it now. It's actually got him thinking. Wait a minute. 120 miles, it don't make sense. Is my son talking any sense here? But he will never, he will never, ever, ever believe that because if he believed what I said, that means that he's believed a lie for all his life. So I know he will never believe that. A spaceship has photographed from a height showing there's a curve of the Earth. Right, that's what he's put up. So his brain now is fighting against it. So let's have a look at this. Let's have a look at this picture. And I know what picture he's talking about. But if he wants to know the truth, he will keep looking. Right, 
Yes. So. A picture of her from space. Right, images. Yeah? Right, do you believe any of those are real images? Or are pictures? Do you believe that's... A, do you believe, look, that's a real picture? Yeah. So, let me just show you all. So look, my dad believes they are not CGI, they are real pictures. Look, same as satellite, you will only get CGI pictures. He doesn't know what CGI is. He believes they are, and he will only ever believe they are CGI, uh, real pictures. Look. A no blade spheroid, remember? Neil, Neil the grass. So, you believe, look. That's a picture. NASA admits it's a comp it's a composite image. So it's not a picture. Even NASA will tell you that. That's not a picture, Dad. Come on. So there you go anyway. All I'm saying is it's just something to think about while you're cutting air. Let me get this uh, under the chin. So this comes off now and we're going grade naught. Here we go look. Up the throat. Give me your money. Give me your money. <laughs> no that's my sister. Sorry. <laughs> She come round the other day, did she tell ya? She was pretending she was pretending to be nice to me and everything. I don't know. It's a funny old world, isn't it, Dad? Just laugh. Yeah. Just make them laugh. That's all we're bothered about. <laughs> F everybody else, isn't it? The best thing in life is laughter, isn't it? Doesn't matter what you do, doesn't matter how much money you've got, nothing, no, no amount of money can make you laugh, can it? Ever. <laughs> It's crazy. They teach it, they tell you in school. In school, they teach you, get a job, do this, do that. But they don't tell you about how the fiat currency works, or that a mortgage in French means death pledge, or this and that and the other, or double speak, or uh, your straw man, what your straw man is, or. Uh, anyway, so. Have you got a bit of dandruff, sir? Mm. Right, have you got uh, a parting gift for the viewers? Mm. Come on, you must have something good for, to say. Don't listen to this idiot, he's talking rubbish. <gasps> <laughs> mm. 
That's why you do this thing. Well, either do or don't. It's your choice. That'll do. Right, so this last one then. At Stroke Group, people say to me, how come you Ah, oh. come on dad, you've got the words, he's got a bleeding eye thing, look, oh, right, look, come on, how, how come you are, lay, laying, lazy, lacking, Always happy. And what do you say? What do you say? How come you're always happy? Conversations take a long time in this house. But time doesn't exist, does it? Time isn't linear. Linear time. It's because I'm alive. Yeah. Appreciate what he's saying is you're alive. Appreciate everything that we have, right, in the in the now, isn't it? Yeah? So don't worry about anything. Just be, isn't it? Do, are you guilty of worrying? <laughs> if you worried, if you stopped worrying, would that help you? If you stop worrying, we're trying to help people here. If you stop worrying about things, would that help you? No, you wouldn't know what to think of. You you fill your thoughts every day with worry, don't you? You don't know what to do every day, do you? So you worry, yeah? So what would you be thinking of if you didn't worry? You don't know, because you've only known worrying, haven't you? Right. Let's search uh, whoever on your haircut. Come on. Here we go now. Will it do? Now that's that's the old one on the left. <gasps> what do you mean? I'm an ugly twat. He's calling me ugly. He says you'll never be as you'll never be as handsome as your father. Right. <laughs> Wave goodbye, Dad. Love you all.